steam-assisted gravity drainage is a process by which steam is injected into the reservoir to melt the bitumen to the point where it can be pumped to the surface. The main advantage of in-situ production is that the wells are drilled from a single pad and it's possible from the surface to drill wells that can extend several kilometers in the underground to develop that resource. The environmental impacts of steam-assisted gravity drainage, of course, are much easier to, to mitigate, to manage, because this, the level of disturbance is much smaller. You're not scraping off all the surface soils. You're never fully disrupting those soil processes that you have to reestablish at a mine site uh, from basically from scratch. Virtually no more water will be used out of the Athabasca River because most of the Sagdi water will be treated and reused. Now, are, there, are the impacts real from Sagdi? I, I don't want to minimize the, the, um, the impacts that can occur from vast networks of pipelines. There is an impact from that, particularly to wildlife. You have to manage those. What limitations do you need to put on the amount of, say, linear disturbance and roads so that you can uh, have a minimized impact on those sensitive species such as caribou?